So in this video, we'll have a quiz about the different breathing patterns that you have studied in your step one exam. This quiz will help us identify Cosmol's, Biot's, and Shane Stock's breathing patterns. So let's start. We'll have a scenario with an audio file, and you'll have to match this breathing pattern with the following options. Our first patient is a 30-year-old male who works on a construction site, and as he's working, a brick fell on his head and he was not wearing a helmet. The patient immediately lost conscious and he was brought to the ER. Upon reviewing his history, we discovered that he was not a smoker and he never had any illnesses before. And he is only taking map for recurrent heartburn. And here is how the patient was breathing. Which of the following is the breathing pattern the patient is displaying? The patient has a brain injury, and of course we know the brain injury is associated with Bios breathing pattern. Indeed, the patient is displaying Bios breathing pattern. As you can see, there is a period of apnea, followed by rapid breathing, and followed by another period of apnea. We know that severe brain injury inhibits the respiratory center and it can only be stimulated again by a rapid increase in carbon dioxide levels. The patient will rapidly breathe to wash out the carbon dioxide and so the respiratory center will be unstimulated and he will have another period of apnea and the cycle continues. Our second patient is a 65 year old male he was watching TV with his wife when he suddenly felt severe chest and abdominal pain and then he lost consciousness. He was brought to the ER and upon reviewing his file we discovered that he is a heavy smoker with 30 pack year smoking and he is also mild adherent to his hypertension medications. When we examined the patient this is what we heard. The scenario is strongly suggestive of myocardial infarction and of course we know that Shane Stokes pattern is associated with myocardial infarction. In fact, any cardiac injuries can cause this. And indeed we see the patient displaying apnea followed by gradual increase then gradual decrease of breathing then another period of apnea. And this is descriptive of Shane Stokes breathing pattern. Our next patient was a passenger in an airplane and he was eating cookies when he didn't realize they had nuts. The patient was allergic to nuts. He then quickly developed shortness of breath and this is what we heard. <sighs> Which of the following is the breathing pattern the patient is displaying? This is rapid breathing or tachypnea. As you can see, the tidal waves are rapid and short. Because the airway is obstructed, the patient is gasping for air in rapid short breaths. And our final example is a 13 year old patient who is known for type 1 diabetes and he presented to the ER with chest pain and cough. He was quickly diagnosed with pneumonia and giving antibiotics. The antibiotics were not given due to physician error. The patient quickly developed a strange breathing pattern and this is what we heard. <sighs> Ah. 
What is the breathing pattern displayed? This is descriptive of diabetic ketoacidosis, as patients with type 1 diabetes are prone to developing this condition upon stress. In this case, the stress was a respiratory infection. The acidity of the blood will be very high, and they will compensate by expelling as much carbon dioxide as possible. Because carbon dioxide is itself acidic, by expelling it, they will decrease the acidity of the blood. And they will accomplish this by rapid high altitude and very long breathing. Unlike tachypnea, which is shallow rapid breaths, Cosmo's breathing pattern is high altitude rapid breaths, which means the patient will intake as much air and exhale as much air as possible. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching and hopefully this helps.